Hello everyone, thanks for tuning in again. I'm going to continue my series with the Sangled Element Classic bulbs, the A19 Smart Bulbs there that Sangled puts out. What we're going to do today is we're going to connect it to our Alexa application. So of course, if you have an Amazon Echo, Echo Plus, what have you, go ahead and mute the mic right now. What I will say is that this video is going to specifically deal with an Echo Plus that has the Zigbee hub built right in. So keep that in mind. I'm gonna show you how to make that connection directly and without a single element hub whatsoever. All right, well, we're gonna start right into the Alexa app here and we're gonna jump right up into the menu and head to the smart home section. Once in the smart home section, I'm just gonna show you because I have a Samsung Smart Things and I've already set up my bulb, it's here. It's called Bedroom Lamp One right now. I can turn it on through Smart Things. That's not the point of this video. I'm gonna show you how to do it without your any other hub at all. So we're gonna hit Add Device. Now just for a moment, let's pretend that your Sangled Element Classic did not actually show up after you discovered devices. There's a number of reasons. First off, make sure that your bulb is on. If it's on and it's still not being found, here's what you need to do. You actually have to click the bulb on and off 10 times consecutively and very quickly with no pauses in the middle. So you'll see on this first attempt, I had a little pause and it did not work. But on the second attempt, it worked completely and you'll notice that the bulb flashes five times after I complete the sequence of 10. That means the bulb has now been reset and your Alexa or your Echo device will find your new Sangled Element Classic bulb. You go ahead, you add device again and it goes through the process. Now you have to make sure your bulb is on then you're going to get the new bulb and you can see it was named First Light. So I'm going to scroll down to First Light here. There it is and I can tap on it to edit. You can see it's on, it's set to 100%. I can tap to turn it off, I can tap to turn it back on and then I can use the slider to go back and forth. I can also edit the name up in the top right and if I wanted I could delete this and change a number of the other components here. So I'm just gonna call it test lamp for now. And we're gonna go back. And you're gonna see it has moved in my devices list. And there it is down at the bottom. Now heading over to groups, I'm gonna add a group. So you can add a smart home group and put any set of bulbs or devices that you have inside your Alexa app. So I'm just gonna call this the office group. I'm going to add in my Echo Plus and I'm gonna add in my basement office hue light that I already had connected a previous time and now I'm going to add in test lamp. Now I tap on save and there I have a group called office. The other thing I can do is I can actually create routines here. Now, I already have a routine, so I'm just going to go into that routine. And I'm going to add a new action. Tap on Smart Home. And now I could control a device, a group, or a scene. So I'm just going to add the device just for demo purposes. You could add a group or a scene. There's my table lamp, I'm gonna tap on that. I can choose the brightness I want it to turn on. I'll leave it to 50% and you can see it's up at the top of the routine now. If I want it, I could actually grab it just using those dots on the left, pull it up and down the routine to place it wherever I wanted. Let's go ahead, let's do a demo. I'm gonna show you all the different ways that you can use this just through your voice control with your Echo or your Alexa enabled device. Alexa, turn test lamp off. Okay. Alexa, turn test lamp on. Okay. 
Alexa, turn test lamp to 100%. Okay. Alexa, turn on office group. Okay. All right, well, there you go. You're all connected. You can see that, you know, if you had another Zigbee style hub in your home, you could go ahead and you could connect through that route. So, you know, I showed you the Samsung SmartThings hub had a connection to my Sangled Element Classic bulb and that brought it into my Alexa enabled assistant there. But if you just have an Echo Plus, it has a Zigbee hub right in it and therefore it can connect directly to those bulbs. So hopefully this was a really helpful video for you. If it was, there's a subscribe button here for you coming right up. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.